Hi team, I want to take a moment and talk about Alconin boxes. You're going to see here it's, a, it's an activity and it's a phonemic awareness activity involving phonemic segmentation. In this activity, using Alconin boxes, the teacher provides a visual cue or picture of, uh, of an object that they want a student to sound out the individual phonemes in. Now in this one right here, you're going to notice it's a picture. It's not a word. And in this picture, the student will look at the picture and say, cat. And with that cue, so there's no print involved, they would sound out the individual phonemes they hear in cat. They wouldn't have to write down that it's made up of a C, an A, a T, because that would be phonics. That would be sort of matching up the sounds with letters and letter sound correspondence. But this is just matching up the sounds that they hear in oral language in the word cat. And here they just have to put a peg or check in the box for every unique phoneme or sound. So for cat, they would say cat is made up of k, a, uh, t, three sounds. I hear three sounds. So Conan Boxes is used to uh, test phonemic awareness, and it specifically has students isolate and identify how many phonemes are in a word. Using Conan Boxes, there is no print, no letters, no words involved. The teacher provides a visual, a picture, and that prompts the student to say the word orally and then to identify the individual sounds in the word. A teacher could also use this, instead of using a picture, they could hold up an object, an everyday object. For example, like I could hold up a marker here and the students could, the teacher could say, what is this? And the students could say, marker. And then from that visual prompt, as long as it's a visual prompt, whether it's a picture or actual object, from there they could start to pronounce the individual phonemes they hear in the word. So it's a great activity to test phonemic awareness and to have students segment and identify the individual phonemes in a word. Hi team, this is Chris Abraham from Go Academy. If you like this video, press the like button below or subscribe to our channel. This allows us to do more videos for teachers on their teacher certification exams. And if you need additional help, you can come and check out a Go Academy workshop or webinar or tutoring. You go to www.goacademy.com. Have a great day, everyone. Bye-bye.